Over the past six years, the Derby for the Vets raised close to $60,000 for veterans. And they're bringing it back again for a seventh year now. The Valley Today's Abby Furchner has already been racing some derby cars this morning. <laughs> she joins us live from the VFW in downtown Fargo with more on this big fundraiser. Good morning, Abby. Yeah, good morning, you guys. We won first place the last heat. We're going to try again here in a little bit, but you're going to hear a lot of cheering from the VFW if you come out at noon tomorrow for the seventh annual Derby for the Vets. Vets. And I'm here with Dan Jacobson, who is the director of the Derby. And for those who this might be their first time coming out or this is their first time hearing about it, what can they see when expect when they come out to the VFW tomorrow? Well, it's going to be get down here quick because at, at noon, noon we're going to start with the opening ceremonies and that's really fun it's really good the color guard and everything the mayors are all here so yeah it's it's really tremendous and, and we want you to come down get a seat get early we're going to be open at 11 o'clock ready to go so Ooh, early admission but admission to this event is free it's free it's free 21 or plus 21 plus but but yeah, yeah. And so people can come and watch the races, but if they want to get in on the race tomorrow, they can buy their own car. Oh, absolutely, yeah. And it's a good good time. You can you can enter for next year, you know, and get your car ready and, and um, be a champion next year. So once again, that's at noon, and there's going to be a silent auction going on as well with over 200 different items you can browse through. And so we're going to see if Valley News Live makes it again this heat we did switch out a car and now we have um, more head in to race again so here we go oh no we didn't win Moorhead we won. didn't win that one crushed it but that's okay it's because okay. jordan jordan we'll do another head he was I, cheering for the I, I car. do i maybe <laughs> weighted that one down just a little bit but the last one yeah the valley news live one on the far right <laughs> last heat we we took home first place in that one we're just tired after the first race we need a little more time between <laughs> Abby Furchner reporting live from the VFW this morning. Thank you.